Someone's awake again. Watch out. Oh. Whew. I think we need another mattress for this, don't we? <laughs> yeah, you kind of blacked out again. So what I did was uh, put the compress on your head. You're going to be fine. I did check and I also did some research on the head when you have. You're going to be fine. It technically only started bleeding a lot because I didn't actually put the compress on it correctly uh, when I first dragged you here with my sister. And. Sorry. Exhausted. You would have thought I would be able to carry someone of the same build. And I can't. Oh. Yeah, I would was struggling if I were you uh, while you were blacked out again. I also kind of tied you up again. And in the same way my sister was with uh, the restraints on the pole right there. And yeah, I can't understand a word you're saying because uh, the thing over your mouth. I did that to avoid any... Nah. <laughs> Yeah, I mean, don't worry, it's not like I've done anything with my sister's body, not yet. I mean, it's broad daylight, what am I supposed to do? Carry my dead twin sister around like that? Yeah, can't do that. So, what I'm going to do is you know, wait till it's a little bit darker, and then I'll do it. Oh, I didn't get a blood on me. There is a bit on the floor I'm going to have to clean up. Uh, 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 uh. Shh. Shh. You know, you can scream and muffle as much as you want, but it's not going to change anything. I'm here, my sister isn't, and you are now a little too restrained to do much. I don't know what I'm going to do with you yet, though. So much I didn't plan for, and I really should have. But hey, I didn't know you were going to notice my toe, did I? Shouldn't have gone too much in the moment with that. <sighs> what to do with you? What to do with you? I know I've got songs in my head for that. <laughs> but yeah. I mean, after I get rid of my sister's body, what I do with you is a different matter. I mean, do I keep you here the same way and then supposed to be the same way if you get too much involved? Now you're pretty strong, I don't know yet. But with those knots, you're not that strong. Look. I think I can tell you more honesty than I could with my sister. Aside from the open up to about favourites thing, which you probably didn't know about. The killing her thing was actually just a threat. I thought when we struggled, I may stab her in the arm, stab her in the leg, or something just to make her back off. I didn't know that. She would get stabbed in the chest. We were just fighting, the knife was here, and next thing I knew. Yeah, you can look at me like I didn't mean to, like I did, like I did plan to, but I didn't. All mouth and no trousers, I should say. But that's happened. So, I'm just going to leave you here for now, tied up and able to speak. I mean, all I've done is lock my sister's body somewhere at this room. It would be fair of me for you, fair of me, to leave you wandering here wondering 
I shouldn't have said that, considering you're a little too tied down. Okay, that I did on purpose. It would be fair for me to leave you here and then just stare at my sister and your girlfriend's dead body. Especially when there's blood gushing out of her chest. That wouldn't be fair of me to just leave you leave you with that? No. Yeah, what do I care about being fair? I can feel you're about to say that. Because there ain't this thing is a little too high around the mouth. I don't think you'll be able to physically say that. So I'm just gonna leave you here for now, fix my hair, I think. But again, when you did hang out with my sister, she had lots of phrase at the back and you seem to love it. What if I leave like that, you'll love me as well. Oh, stop with the struggle. Ah, ah, shh, shh, shh. I said this to my sister, and I'll say this to you. No one can actually hear you. The gag is uh, more of a precaution. But also because... Well, this wasn't the case for my sister, it's the case for you. How are you doing that muffled sound is... It's kind of a turn on. <laughs> I don't know why, but it is. Seeing you there, laying there, helpless, scared, angry, and I don't know what else. That chair's a little bit on the floor. Maybe I should clean that up first before I go anywhere. But... I don't think I'll worry about that yet. I, mean, I know what I just said, but maybe I will leave it for a minute. Because I don't think I'm going to be too crying over my sister to worry about her blood on the floor. Because if you see that, that's just going to make you feel worse. Or you're going to make you feel more determined to try and get out of here yourself. I think about what to do with you. I don't really want to kill you, so. And I listen to that part that I don't want to. But I will if I have to. So. My newly found little hostage. Try not to struggle or scream too much. This is going to wear you out. I'm gonna leave you to it. 